Hello friends. Today we are going to study about the cancer. So what is the cancer? So cancer is a disease, and in that disease condition, the uncontrolled, unorganized, and abnormal growth of cells that forms a mass or group of undifferentiated malignant cells, and that leads to the formation of tumor. So this tumor and the disease condition is called as the cancer. So in in case of the cancer, the word comes from the Greek word called as kerkinos and the Latin word called as cancrum. So this means the crab. So we know the when crab is attached to the any surface, it is not easily detached. It is not easily removed from that surface. Likewise, this deadly disease called as the cancer, this cancer cannot be removed from the organ where it is occurs. So we cannot remove the cancer from that particular organism from that particular body part so this is a deadly disease so cancer in case of the cancer after the growth the tumor interferes with the normal functioning of the different organs of the body means whenever this cancer is present in the organ system that cancer changes the function of that organ system because there are so many things that can uh, present that the properties of the cancer cells properties of the particular tumors that changes the body functions for example the secretions of the cancer cells the so secretions of the cancer cells that change the body functions now the scientific study of the cancer is called as the oncology and the students or the researchers or the physicians those who are involved in study diagnosis treatment and prevention of the cancer are called as the oncologists that means the oncologists they are involved in study diagnosis treatment and the prevention of the cancer remember well now the tumors that may be develop anywhere tumor that may develop anywhere in the body system and all the tumors they they may not be the cancerous some tumors they are non cancerous and some tumors they be cause the cancer now there are the there are the two types of the tumors based on the spreading in the body system first is the benign tumor now benign or non malignant tumor so what is the meaning of benign benign is nothing but non harmful now in this tumor this tumor grows slowly but that may attain a large size and this tumor remain at the site of its origin only and it is not spreading throughout the body system now this benign tumor that is the tumor uh, that is not harmful tumor and some benign tumors are harmful remember well some benign tumors may be harmful and that may lead to the death for example brain tumor now brain tumor that is occurring under the hard skull therefore that may lead to the disease now the benign tumors sometimes that may become the malignant that means benign tumors converts into the malignant tumor example is adenoma and the fibroid so this is the first type that is called as the benign tumor second is called as the malignant tumor now remember when well, this malignant tumor is called as the cancer this is the harmful and this is the disease the condition now see this tumor that grows rapidly that means very fast growth occurs in malignant tumor and mortality rate also observed more as compared to the benign tumor now the rapid growth of the tumor that causes the overcrowding and disruption of normal cells that means where there is more growth of the tumor there normal cells they are harmed they get harmed now the cancer cells fight with the normal cells for getting the nutrients and finally kill the normal cells that means suppose there is one location and in that location cancer cells are growing now the cancer cells they will take more nutrients and they will kill the normal cells and therefore the cancer cells will grow rapidly 
and they change the body functions, body part. Now, these cancerous cells, they are spreading from one organ to the other by means of the blood or limb and they form the new tumors in new location and those are called as secondary tumors. That means this particular tumor that is malignant tumor that can spread from one location to the another location. Now the malignant tumor this is the my, this migratory process observed in malignant tumor that is called as metastasis. This property is called as metastasis. So there are the two different types of the tumors. One is benign tumor, second is the malignant tumor. Benign tumor that is non-harmful, malignant tumor is harmful. Malignant tumor is also called as the cancer. Now we will differentiate between these two types of the tumors. So the first is the benign tumor, second is the malignant tumor. In case of the benign tumor, the metastasis is not observed and in case of the malignant tumor metastasis is observed you can clearly see here the second property or the second in case of the uh, in the second you will observe that the the benign tumor is covered by the capsule and malignant tumor is not covered by the capsule now benign tumor is present in the oval shape malignant tumor is present irregularly that means malignant tumor shows irregular shape benign tumor that attaches to the surface so the cells are more adhesive in benign tumor malignant tumor cells are less adhesive in malignant tumor cells are less adhesive now tumor they are uh, in benign tumor, tumor is invasive and in malignant tumor is invasive. Invasive means what? They are enter inside the tissue. So that is invasiveness observed in benign tumor. Malignant tumor they do not show the invasiveness problem. Malignant tumor that shows the invasiveness. Benign tumor that do not show the invasive property. Now tumor cells they are well differentiated in case of the benign while in case of the malignant tumor cells are undifferentiated now differentiation and undifferentiation means what uh, there is the property for the cells so cells we got a particular type of the function then that type of cell is called as differentiated cells and if the cells they do not have a particular type of the function then those are called as undifferentiated cells. So differentiated cells observed in benign tumor, undifferentiated cells observed in malignant tumor. Now the benign tumor that grows very slowly, while the malignant tumor that grows rapidly. Now benign tumor that do not shows that does not shows the any pain. In case of the malignant tumor, there is the there we observe the pain painful actions now in case of the benign tumor tumor is tumor can be removed that is called as excised surgically tumor can be removed surgically in case of the malignant tumor tumor cannot be cured by surgery surgically that means if we make a surgical operation at one location before doing that surgical operation that particular tumor might be spread at other location so in case of the malignant tumor we cannot cure this particular cancer by the surgery that is possible in case of the benign tumor and last thing that is the mortality rate is very low in case of benign tumor in case of the malignant tumor mortality rate is very high so here today we studied the what is the mean by cancer again the properties of benign and malignant tumor and we have differentiated between the benign tumor and the malignant tumor. Thank you.